Here we're going to be working in the analyzer and working with online video files. So if we don't have the footage locally on our computer, but we have access to the link online or it's saved into your documents collection, you can open up the properties of the game and you can link the video in the online video location bar. So you can click this button here, choose somewhere in your documents, or if you have another web location, you can paste the URL in here as long as it ends in .mp4. So here I've got some footage from VO. I can copy this link here, head over to XPS, paste this in, and now if I go to open up the game, I can see everything that I've tagged. I can go in and click, watch the footage, tag, draw on the footage, and share just like you normally would. So just remember, I don't have this video locally on my computer, but just because I have the link from VO, or if you have the MP4 link from anywhere else, I can now open it up and you have full features that you usually would when you had the video locally stored. And this is the same if you try and link it to somewhere in your documents collection, because remember everything that gets uploaded that's a video is converted into MP4. And this is really great for staff who might not have access to the video locally, they can get access to the URL, open up the file and do everything they usually could as if they had the file locally. You can also move the events from the game similar to working locally. If we opened up the events, which is showing us the clips that we've tagged and maybe we wanted to look at all of the goals that the white team scored. So I'll just select them here. We've got four clips. I can merge them together, cut them up, share them. In this case, we're going to send it to our presenter. We can save that as our white goals. And when we open up the presenter, we have our presentation here. So here we've got the four clips that we've tagged from the online video, which should all be goals. And you can edit, draw, put voiceover as you usually would if you're working with a local video, except this time, it's directly from an online source.